Hello, and welcome to day two of The Sims 3 Volition Hunger Games final season, season 11. So far, we have had two deaths. Um, Stephen Horn and Brittany Smith both spontaneously combusted at the same time outside. So that was a very, very, very dramatic. Um, and entertaining. There was a dance-off competition yesterday, and Mark Q. Turner in Evil Eads came in in second and third, so they got some honey. Mark Q. Turner is just collecting food. Um, he has some honey, he has an apple, so I mean, he's kind of hungry, but he's doing okay. He's not starving yet, because um, he ate his honey. Um, and everyone else is pretty full, other than, uh, I think, maybe Mark Q. Turner in Evil Eads, actually, unfortunately for them. Um, and then Jordan Lynn won. Um, he didn't get to bring Zelly in, but he did save Zelly from spontaneously combusting outside. So um, that's how things went down. At the beginning of day two, we will go ahead and Jordan's had... Eh, he's had enough time in there. We'll go ahead and wake him up in just a little bit. Um, whenever we're ready to start the next competition. Um, that's where they died out there. There is Devin Barkley working on equations with bats floating above him because he's a vampire. Um, let's see, our unicorn is very sad. I don't know why. Um, you know what we're going to do? We're going to have the unicorn go and bless Zelly at the beginning of this day because I remembered. Um, he's upset because he's had a saddle on for too long. So maybe someone will unsaddle him. Go bless Elijah, who is your alliance, unicorn. No. Friendly. Bless Fauna. I'll only try one more time. Bless him. Well, that's fancy. So he receives for eight hours the unicorn's blessing, plus 40 mood. Um, so good for him. So, yeah, we'll try to give that to him at the start of every video for every day. Um, Morgan is... How is Morgan doing? Wow, Morgan is doing really great. Um, Mark Turner is doing really great. He's, of course, playing music. Evil Eads is... He's going to pee his pants. Maybe. Um, Fairy Mansfield's very sleepy. Jordan is doing great. Justin Heath is doing pretty good. Elijah's doing pretty good, but he's got pee. Um, nope, Evil Leads made it, and Elijah will not. Oh, yay! Derek unsaddled the horse. Derek's like, Derek's from the country. Derek's like, you guys, you need to unsaddle the horse. Derek has been going around taking care of and being best friends with the animals, like hardcore. Um, okay, so we are going to go ahead. What is he going to do to me? Oh, he's going to go ask me about his, my day. That is so nice of you, Derek. That is so nice of you. Okay, so... Hmm. I didn't set up properly the failure competition. Um, I don't really want to set it up. It's a pain in the butt to set up, so I really don't want to. Um, let me think. What's going to be the, the losing thing? The loser... Top two have to do fire room. That's what we'll do. Okay, so we're going to do chemistry. Um, we're doing science, guys. Um, everybody's competitions are something people suggested. Um, so, like, the first one was a dancing competition. We had a lot of people that said they like dance-offs. So we did a dance-off competition. Um, and then for today, a lot of people said they like the competitions where they make things. Um, so we're going to do a chemistry competition. Um, we're going to have them all discover a potion. And if you discover a potion, I will allow you to use that potion at an opportune time. Or if you die, it goes on to somebody, they can use it. Um, however, if you just stop, decide you're not going to invent anymore, then, then the first two to stop go in the fire room. Everyone else, you're free to go. You're free to go. Um... So it's not really, it doesn't really matter how quickly you do it. So I'm just going to have people in order um, from top to bottom go do it. Um, this is not looking good for Derek. Okay, Derek, I'm sorry. Go discover a potion. Elijah, go discover a potion. 
Justin Heath, you must go discover a potion. Jordan, your time is done. You must go discover a potion. Um, Morgan, you must go discover a potion. Look at Elijah glowing. Um, Ryan Mansfield, you must also go discover a potion. This is not looking good for him. Um, I guess technically, maybe we won't even do first to quit gets to lose because we're not doing it all at the same time. So, um... How about as long as you attempt it? If you won't even attempt it, if you're just like, I'm not going to do that, then you have to go in the fire room. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's just... We just won't have a negative. If you get a potion, you get a potion. If you don't, you don't. There we go. There it is. That's all there is to it. So people are discovering potions right now. Um, Jordan has actually, I don't remember, this is logic skill based, so let's see. Um, I mean, Derek has a six, so that's pretty good. Um, if he can keep going long enough to discover one. Elijah has a four, so we'll see. Uh, Justin Heath has, like, he has nothing? What? He has a five. Um... Jordan Lynn has a five. Oh, Derek is done. So Derek has given up. Um, fair enough, though. Oh, Ryan Mansfield, who is very, very tired and I didn't actually think would make it, has discovered a, a radical repair on potion. So if he ever has to repair something, he will be good to go. So congratulations, Ryan Mansfield. Oh, no, no, no. I have an idea. I have an idea. Um, if the station explodes on you, you have to go um, into a fire room. There we go. If you get exploded. There we go. Um, okay, so we have not had Mark Turner do this. You must discover potion, Mark Turner. Elijah Zelli has given up. Jordan has given up. Morgan has given up. Everybody is giving up, it looks like. But not, not Ryan Mansfield. He's getting potions. Where's your potion at? I didn't give him his. Oh, it's broken. My interfaces. It thinks. You know, I've had this happen before, and it's not cool. Um. Evil Eats is discovering. Devon Barkley, you must go discover. Um, he has his potion. I just can't see it currently. So, I don't know. But we'll... Maybe I'll restart my game or something and look into it so I can actually see the backpack. I've had this happen before and it's not cool. Um, everybody still has the correct items, you just can't see them. Oh! Evil Eads got exploded! Fiddlesticks. Evil Eads, you're gonna have to go into the fire room! Ah ha 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 ha! Devin Barkley is going to experiment. Mark Turner is over here experimenting. Um, Evil Leads, we will make it so that you have to survive a fire. Um, so we're just going to stick you in until it catches on fire. If you survive, good for you. If you don't, then that stinks for you. So there's plenty of room to navigate um, and survive if you want. Um, but you don't have to, so evil leads. Go here, evil leads. Light that fire. Oh. Teleport you here. 
Now go light that fire. Let's see. Mark U Turner still might discover something. So might um, Vampire. Devin Barkley. Oh! Vam uh, Vampire Devin Barkley made stink juice, which is not super helpful. And Mark devised the bladder flow potion, which will cause somebody to pee their pants. We shall give it to him to use on his greatest enemy before a competition. Before the next competition. And we will do the same thing to him before the next competition. Derek Wade is playing with and feeding the cow plant. Cow plants aren't hungry yet, so they're not a danger yet. Um, so that is a good thing. Um, we will see after Vampire Eats if he can survive this or if he cannot. I do not know. But we will find out. Let's see. I'm surprised. Oh, wow. Wow, look at him go. Or not vampire eads, evil eads. Um, now my pictures aren't even updating. Ooh, I hate whenever this happens. Um, you can't trust their health bars either, really. Or maybe you can, but soon you're not going to be able to. Um, so let's see how people are doing. Derek Wade is going to take a bath, which he really just needs to go to the bathroom. That is what Derek Wade really needs. Um, I need to remember to reset that more. Elijah Zelly is sleeping in his sleeping bag. Justin Heath and Morgan are attracted to each other. Jordan Lynn is in here talking with the doggy. Morgan Ledbetter is crying, but she's doing pretty well. Uh, Ryan Mansfield is sleeping. Mark Hugh Turner is sleeping in a sleeping bag that he brought with him. Evil Leeds is not caught on fire yet. Devin Barkley is going to go and he wants to play at the cow plant. Um, we're gonna Doc Brown go here and make some food for people. What are you doing? Who are you? You're Jordan Lynn. Jordan Lynn is not turning into a werewolf on and off a lot like he was last time. Um, let's go ahead and do something interesting. We will turn up. Maybe it's because I have full moon turned off. So we're going to turn it on to have full moon. So at night he will at least become a werewolf. And then he has the option if he wants to to turn it on and off. His call. Um... Yes, yeah, so we are making food. And we're just going to put out two plates right now. Because there's lots of people who are uh, pretty okay. Like, nobody's really starving. Continue cooking that Doc Brown, please. Don't catch it on fire, please. Please don't catch it on fire. Please, 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 please don't catch it on fire. <laughs> no. Oh, man, I need to turn that off. Um. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so now nobody will ever get teleported out because it thinks they're stuck anymore. We're good. Um. Go ahead and put that down. I'm going to grab another plate, and I'm going to move this in here for somebody to eat. I'm going to move this in here for somebody else to eat, and Doc Brown may eat that food in the kitchen so that he gets something to eat. Um, and I'm going to have him put that away. that up, and then we're going to have him go here. Um, Let's see. Evil Eads is playing Hacky Sack directly in front of the fire, which just, to me, seems like an absolutely horrible idea. Uh, not something you want to do. Like, a really, really, really bad idea. Um, and here's the fire, but 
But fortunately for him, it did not just pop out into him. It uh, came to the right into the plant. So, um, Evil Lead stands a chance. He stands a chance, guys. Right now he is losing out the chance to get food. In fact, did somebody else get food? Jordan Lynn. My dogs got teleported outside. My dog and my cat did. Okay then. Weird. Um. Let's see. Did Jordan Lynn get food? Jordan? Looks like Jordan ate some food and Justin Heath ate some food. They're the two that got full. The fire is coming Eads's way. Evil Eads has survived fire rooms in the past. So, oh no, he is not in a good spot. Will he move? He did move. Oh no, this room is just kind of small and it's kind of not going good. I think it's got him. Oh, he is avoiding as best this guy can. I don't think he's gonna make it though. Jeremia Mankiss wants to know if Emmett Brown would like to go on a date. <laughs> she would. Jeremia Mankiss is the offspring of um, Eric Montano and Jasmine Mankiss. Um, sure, he wants to go on a date. Oh my gosh, is he going to survive this? Is he going to survive this? It's going out. It's right next to him. Oh my gosh. He survived it. Somehow this guy survived it. Wow. I am super impressed. So, um, didn't think that would happen. I've never seen that much of a close call before. Ever. Okay, put out the fire, Eads. Put out the fire. And you're free to go. You are free. Have fun. Doc Brown, what are you doing? Wow, he is filthy. Um, okay, so let's see. Is anybody here starving? Derek is not. Elijah is not. He is not. He is not. Morgan is not. Ryan Mansfield is not. Mark Turner is not. Looks like nobody is starving. But people are peeing their pants all over the place. Um, we will bring our cats back inside. And our dog back inside, who for some reason got outside. I don't know why. Oh no, and I forgot, we never put the door back in. So, I owe a door outside. So yeah, we had one close death, but not a death. And, um, that's just gonna be... We're gonna call this a day. I mean, we had a competition, we had some items people got... We had Eads almost die, but Evil Eads is a survivor, and he did not die. Oh my gosh. Um, so, that happened. I was about ready to, like, start giving away his stuff, you know? I was just like, he's not gonna make it. So, I mean, proved me wrong. Um, so yeah, we'll just, uh, call this a day, and I will see you guys tomorrow on day three.